Check it out, Squirt. No hands. You mean no brains? I can't look. Ooh, come on, Josh. This is a patrol mission, not a joyride. But haven't you ever heard of multitasking? Whoa. <laughs> giant snowball thingy? It's headed right toward Earth! Don't worry, Yoko. It's just a hunk of space ice. It'll melt long before it reaches our atmosphere. Translation, chill. <laughs> yeah! Attention all! Don't miss tonight's special Emperor from Outer Space. Screening starts in Hall F64 at 8 p.m. Don't forget the popcorn! <laughs> Hey, what you got there, boy? Duh! It's a cyber flyer, the latest in GH messaging technology. <laughs> come one, come all to the first annual Galaxy High Open Mic Night. Uh, who's Mike? And why do we have to open him? Devil duh! Mike isn't a who, it's a what. And what it is, is the chance of a lifetime for talented students to strut their stuff on stage. <laughs> but all the sign-up slots are taken by you. So? <laughs> so doesn't that make it more of a closed mic night? Oh, I had no choice. I need one slot to sing, two slots to dance, and three slots for my acting routines. <laughs> you forgot a slot for your encore. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, Josh. Yeah. <laughs> Laugh all you want. All I can say is it's tough being the shining star of Galaxy High. Good morning, students. I have a few important announcements. Please be on the lookout for a missing ultra pet responding to the name Wiggly. And please be aware that Spyset has picked up chatter indicating a possible attack on the school from unknown alien forces. All cadets are to be on high alert. Have a nice day. Whoa, that's scary. What, the possible attack or the fact that my dad led with the missing ultra pet story? Hold it right there. Hey, it's okay. I'm not an intruder. I'm Craig, with a K. And I'm Principal Kirkpatrick, also with a K. Let me apologize for the lukewarm welcome. We're on high alert and weren't expecting any new cadets today. Just give me a moment to look you up in the system. Hmm, well, that's odd. They don't have any record of you, Craig. Oh, are you sure? Hmm. Oh, here you are. Guess my eyes were playing tricks on me. Happens to me all the time, sir. Hmm. Your credentials are very impressive. Excellent grades, remarkable athletic testing, and an accomplished artist to boot. I have no doubt you'll be a model cadet. Uh, nice of you to say, but I'm just hoping to fit in. Awesome! A mini black hole! An interesting observation, cadet. Huh? Now, what would happen if I released this pencil into what Brett claims is a black hole? Oh, I wouldn't have to take notes anymore. Oh, please, like you ever do. Oh, oh, I know! Nothing! Hmm. I mean, uh, nothing would happen. Material only falls into a black hole when it bumps into other material. Huh? How could the laws of astrophysics have been broken? Because it was a trick question. You see, that isn't a black hole. It's a vacuum. You must be Craig, the new student principal Kirkpatrick is raving about. Where did you attain your scientific training, son? In a small Canadian town called Kalevin. It's near Vancouver. Wow, it's great to finally have a fellow physics fanatic in class. You want to be my study buddy? Hmm. Smooth riding, man. Hey, thanks. Follow my lead. I'll show you some new tricks. Or I can follow your lead. <laughs> Apparently, this simulation isn't challenging enough for some cadets. Now, let's see who can perform a quadruple barrel roll with a single inside edge wheel landing. No problem. Finally, someone who appreciates a good joyride. Hey, you want to hang out later?
A priceless interpretation of the ICK-11 galaxy, Yoko. Oh, thanks, Mr. S. I worked on it for months. Unfortunately, there's something missing from your mobile. You failed to capture the true evil of K-11. Here, I'll show you with my hologram. Hmm. Whoa, you're right. The creepy hologram totally says it all. But I didn't activate the hologram. That's somebody's project. Just something I whipped up this afternoon. It's nothing. Whoa, if that's nothing, I'd love to see something. Indeed. This is positively outstanding work, Craig. Hey, Yoko, since Craig is an artist like you, why don't you make room for him in your open mic night? Oh, great idea, Brett. But you'll have to audition like everybody else. Cool. Cheers to the mighty Galaxy High. For you, we will fight to save the spirit of our Galaxy High, the symbol of the brave. Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh! <laughs> Whoa, what is that thing? The plan to assimilate is working perfectly. The humans don't suspect a thing. Excellent. Now that you've gained their trust, you can proceed to phase two. Did I tell you Craig fixed the fan belt on my motorcycle? to meet a super smart overachiever who's also down to earth. And I gotta say, it's nice having a friend my dad actually approves of. Hey, speaking of your dad, why don't you ask him if Craig can join our team? Good call, Brett. Hey, what do you think, Yoko? No! I don't care how smart you think Craig is or how good he is at fixing things, he's not joining our team! Whoa! What's with the sudden hostility fest, yo? Yeah, why are you being so hard on the new guy? Because I've got a weird feeling about him. And if you don't believe me, check out my intergalactic tarot card reading. Huh? See? This card tells me somebody I know is hiding something. All I see is that you're big time jealous. Jealous? Please! What can I possibly have to be jealous of? Uh, I don't know. Maybe the fact that Craig's a better artist than you? Or perhaps it's because he's a superior juggler slash entertainer? Hmm? I am not jealous. I just trust my instincts. And my instincts tell me Craig is up to no good. I mean, think about it. There's just no way someone could be that perfect. Jealous and envious. Whew. This is worse than I thought. Craig is evil, and I'm going to prove it. Hey there, study buddy. Ready to hit the books? Yeah, actually, I was hoping we could do something a little more exciting, like take a field trip to the Galaxy High Defense Shield. Do you happen to know where it is? Well, yeah, but that area is strictly off limits to cadets. Didn't you read that in your student handbook? I guess I didn't get to that part. And besides, Principal K's the only one with a key. Right. Well, then, I guess you better lead the way to the library. Okay, but be careful. Uh, looks like the floor's wet. Hey, it's coming from you. I can explain, but I won't. Okay, time for a background check on Galaxy High's latest, greatest, and easy to hatest. I think I'll start with his hometown of Kalevin. No record found. Okay, let's try the rest of the country. No record found. The rest of the world? No record found. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew something was up with that guy. Josh, this is Yoko. I've got a major 911. Yo, yo, what's up? Are you fixing your bike in your room? Unfortunately, the library was too crowded. Anyway, I just did some research on our friend Craig, and guess what? There's no record of Kalevin in Canada or anywhere else! Uh, and your point? Pretty freaky, huh? I'd hardly call a missing hometown freaky, Yoko. <gasps> oh, well, looks like there's only one way to settle this. Let's go to your dad's office so you can prove me wrong. Hmm. 
Uh, so, Craig, how's your first day of school going? Fitting in like you hoped? Things are going just great, Prince, okay? And they'll be going even better as soon as I get that key to the defense shield. Defense shield? What are you talking about? I'm talking about the key that's going to open the door to the destruction of Galaxy High. Now hand it over. I don't know what you're trying to pull, Cadet, but it won't happen on my watch. Oh, yeah? Watch this. <laughs> Come on, boys! Move it like you mean it! <laughs> I've never seen someone in such a hurry to be proven so wrong! Hey, Dad, what's with the new open door policy? Dad? That's weird. It's not like the Commandant to leave his office unlocked. And it's definitely not like him to keep ice in his supply closet. We better check it out. Whoa! Huh? I gotta say, there have been times I wanted to freeze my dad, but now that it's happened, so not cool! Step back, Josh. Laser photon mode! <laughs> Thanks, Yoko. Dad, who did this to you? C -c Craig, he's an e evil alien. <gasps> now I know why his mobile was so killer. Craig's not from Kalevin, he's from the K11 galaxy. If that's true, then how come we didn't notice some kind of flying ice craft around here? You mean like that giant hunk of ice we saw on our patrol mission? Guess Brett miscalculated the part about it melting by the time it hit our atmosphere. You must hurry, Cadet. He's got the d d defense shield key. Okay, go ahead, say it. Say what? I told you so, I was right and you were wrong. Don't ever doubt the amazing Yoko again. Did you just say the amazing Yoko? Uh, it's my stage name, but there's no time for that now. We've got to stop Craig. Yeah! Whoa, right after we saved the little guy. Fluff, you want to handle this one? Okay. Where's Craig? Let me at him! Let me at him! Hey, get in line, Squirt! He froze my father! And he stole my spotlight, which is why the three of us are gonna take him out together! Attention, all cadets! There's been a breach of the defense shield! Report to your defenders immediately! We're under attack! Looks like we'll have to deal with Craig later! As if! There's no way I'm letting that showboating show off off the hook! But what about the whole saving the school thing? The other cadets will do just fine without us! Right now, it's time to KO Mr. K-11. Attention, Marshals, get to your defenders. This is not a drill. I repeat, this is not a drill. Defenders, launch in three, two, one. Defenders in position. Anybody see our attackers? Ah, nothing yet, Bobby. Uh, guys, looks like we're about to be hit by a massive cold front. Whoa, that's a whole lot of aliens. And we're one team short. Where are Josh, Yoko, and Brett anyway? Knowing them, goofing off. Okay, everyone, fear right. Aye, aye, princess. <laughs> Show your face! Shouldn't be that hard, considering you've got two of them. Okay, come on, you Kalevin Kaloozer! I feel like crushing some ice! Me too! We can crush later! First, we gotta get that shield up! Gonna be kinda hard without this! Help! I've got an icy trail on my tail! I'm all over it! I'm guessing from the frigid temp that Galaxy High forgot to pay its heating bill. <laughs> Luckily, we Canadians are used to the cold. You can put the cool act on ice, Craig. We know you're responsible for the defense breach. Oh, you've got it all wrong, Yoko. I'm a regular student, just like you. You're nothing like me. Unless I 
can't join the evil alien poser club without knowing it. <laughs> Maybe if you weren't such a sensitive artist, we would have gotten along better. I'll show you how sensitive I am. No, I'll show you. <laughs> Okay, study buddy or not, it's time you got schooled! Oof mo Nice attempt, but it's gonna take more than your little earthling toys to defeat me. Oh yeah? Try this! Dazzler mode! I tried it! Wasn't impressed. Okay, now he's just annoying me. Big time! Now to put you in your place! Let's get him! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Sorry about the lack of a view, but believe me, you don't want to see what's going to happen to Galaxy High! I'm hit! I'm hit! Ejection! Ejection! Get out! Get out! Alert! Alert! Enemy tailing you! Go! 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 <laughs> okay! In the Ice Age ends right now, pal. Sonic Blaster Mode! Oh, the sensitive artist is back! <laughs> That's right! Back with a vengeance! <laughs> now who's the sensitive one? lessons instead of that dumb kazoo class. Don't waste your final moments in regret. I couldn't agree more. Sonic Shield mode. No! That's what you get for messing with my open mic night. Uh, Yoko, where are you? Watching a fanny crumble under my awesome feminine powers. What's wrong, baby? If you don't close the defense shield fast, Galaxy High will be closed. Hang tight, I'm on it. All right, I'm officially sick of all this ice. Thanks for busting us out! So, are you okay? Oh, I'm fine, but Craig isn't. You did that? Along with saving our school from K-11 forces by closing the defense shield. Wow, forget the song and dance routines. You're way more suited to be an action hero. Guess we all owe you an apology for accusing you of being jealous of Craig. And for saying how cool Craig was. And for not trusting you to trust your instincts. Okay, okay, that's enough. Your apologies are accepted. Though, there is one thing you can do to make it up to me. Anything. Just name it. Welcome, one and all, to the first annual One Woman Open Mic Night. Now, without further ado, I give you the amazing Yoko. Cheers to the mighty Galaxy High for you we will fight to save the spirit of our Galaxy High, the symbol of the brave! <gasps> Great job! Uh, yeah! Yoko rules! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys! You're a great audience! And now, for my next act, I'm gonna show you what I can really do! 
You get the feeling we're in for a long night? A long day. 